Are you Eric Nelson? Yes. Prosecutors lay out a timeline they say shows Fontenelle Principal Eric Nelson did not report former first grade teacher Greg Sedlacek even after teachers showed him photo evidence of an alleged sexual assault of a child at the school. They told him about it, assuming that it was going to be reported. Uh, he didn't do that. They are two teachers who prosecutors say saw Sedlacek the morning of December 19th with a first grade girl on his lap through their classroom window overlooking the playground. Documents state one teacher took photos and immediately showed Nelson. And that two other times that day, noon and during a planning time, the other teacher asked Nelson about Sedlacek's status. They say Nelson told them he would contact Human Resources and it would be taken care of. Defense attorney Matthew Burns says it was. I do have some documentation that says that there was a call made to HR. Uh, I believe it was on the 19th. Prosecutors say Nelson didn't call and it was only after that teacher saw Sedlacek tutoring a student the next morning that something was done. He still hadn't reported it. Somebody else finally took care of it. Uh, but that was a failure to protect the children who... Uh, perpetrator still had access to those kids. Police say phone records don't show any calls to HR on the 19th and say when the assistant principal called the next day, they told her they weren't aware of any incident. Nelson's attorney says too much pressure is being put on the principal. He's not the only mandatory reporter involved here. Uh, he wasn't the witness. He didn't witness anything. Stuff was brought to him. But if the stuff was so egregious, then why are these teachers, why didn't they call straight off him?